my name is Dr. William and as we are in the month of October Breast Cancer Awareness I can't be silent like that without making awareness of breast cancer so that we all can take care of ourselves we've heard of breast cancer what does it mean and what is the meaning of even cancer itself when we talk of breast cancer we say it's a cancer that developed in the uh, tissue or the cells in the breast that causes damages what to the breast what is cancer itself it's a cancer is a disease that develop in the cells of the body which spread into other parts of the body so cancer is very dangerous it's very bad when it comes to the body it damages what the cells in the body or the tissues in the body so we must be careful of it now let's look at what causes breast cancer so with the causes of breast cancer now we have a genetics what factor what we call family history then we have environmental what factor and we have what we call a lifestyle so let me let me talk about the family history or gen genetics factor so genetics factor that causes a uh, breast cancer can be damaged of a dna if the dna uh, formation is well was damaged or the mutation of uh, of the DNA when the cells were forming if there was some uh, damages it can also causes what a uh, breast cancer let's see the lifestyle that causes breast cancer the lifestyle that causes breast cancer we can talk of smoking we can talk of alcoholism we can talk of too much fat eating we can talk of uh, obesity that is overweight so there are so many uh, causes of breast cancer that what we must be careful about let's see the environmental causes of breast cancer which can be what radi uh, radiology so radiology can cause what breast cancer when we talk of radiologists we are talking about what too much uh, chemicals or what light rays that what passing through the body uh these all causes what uh breast cancer so please let us see the same things things that show up that can uh signify or show a way of what breast cancer now listen not all signs and same things you will identify in your breast can show that there's what a cancer in your body that is why going to the hospital is very very important for a doctor to examine you to assess you to uh, pass you through the necessary process for it to uh, diagnose first before you can see you have a breast cancer now some of the signs and same things that shows uh, breast cancer we can talk of weight in your breast uh, we can talk of discharge from your nipple we can talk of dimpling of your nipple we can of signs and symptoms it can be pains in your uh, in the breast uh, it can be lump or mass in your breast if there is a mass in your breast when you hold it tight mass now listen every woman when you are ovulating the woman is ovulating you can see your breast feel heavy you feel some little mass in there that does not uh, or may not be a sign of breast cancer it may be out of a uh, result of the ovulation that is what costing that I mean your period so uh, that's why I said don't diagnose yourself that you have a breast cancer you must go to the hospital for the doctor to examine you for the doctor to assess you to confirm first before so we must be self-aware you must check yourself be assessing your breast check your breast and see if there's discharge coming from the nipples if you see changes from the breast that's one you must be aware yourself examine yourself assess yourself if you feel pains in the breast you must go to the hospital for a checkup now let's see some of the things that can be used to what to uh, diagnose a uh, breast cancer we, when you go to the hospital that can make you do x-ray uh, they can be ultrasound they there can be MRI. Uh, these are the, uh, some of the labs that or investigation that can be done to determine what uh, breast, what cancer. So please let us be careful. Let's take good care of ourselves. Let's manage our body. Our health is very, very what, important. Get access to your body. Examine your body, observe your body well so that you can signify when there is differences in your body. Thank you so much. My name is Rilia. Bye-bye.